relationship with the Lord Himself and the relation, your relationship with His Word that will make all the difference in the world in your life, be it, be it for good, be it positive, be it of eternal benefit, or be it for evil, be it for your destruction and detriment and of only temporal value. It all depends on your relationship with this book, the Word of God, and your relationship with God Himself. And so tonight, I want to challenge myself and each one of us to have a serious relationship and a seeking of a serious and lifelong relationship that's close and intimate and personal with, uh, with our God and with His Word. Now, it's, these things are best. They're best incorporated. How many of you in this room tonight are 19 years of age or younger? Would you lift your hand? 19 years of age or younger. All right. These principles we're looking at right here, that's, uh, they're best incorporated, biblically speaking, into your life right now. The Bible is not to be, it's, it's just these issues and these wonderful promises from God's Word. If you have a close and personal relationship with God's Word and with God's, God Himself, you're going to see some wonderful promises in here that are just enviable. But don't think that you can fritter away your life and then somewhere later on in life's, uh, in life's pathway say, well, you know, I'm going to get around to that now. You're going to miss out on a lot of blessings that you could have and eternal reward unless you start out right now saying, I am going to give myself to loving God's Word, to living God's Word, to sharing God's Word, and to love and live and to share God with everyone I can. He says over and over again in here, my 